There was a boy studies life that no one would ever want it. And anyone wouldn't expect something extraordinary from the boy. Since it's almost impossible to live even a decent life from that environment. However, the boy built something that our world recognize today. It's called Hyundai. His name is Jung Joo Young. He was a South Korean entrepreneur, businessman, and the founder of Hyundai Groups of South Korea. He was actually born in North Korea in 1915, which was before Korean War, and raised as the eldest son of a poor Korean farmer. At the age of 18, he took off for good to Seoul with only willingness of finding a better life. As we all know, the success never be immediate. He worked hard in various jobs, such as railway construction, bookkeeping, and dock work. His first experience as an entrepreneur came in 1938 when he started his own rice store. However, he was forced to close his business a year later because of the policies of the Japanese occupation forces. Chang explained his success in his statement. Our people succeeded because they devoted their enterprising spirits. They used the forces of other mind. Conviction, grace, indomitable efforts. This is the key to true miracles. Man's potential is limitless. His venture into the shipbuilding business is a legendary. Despite a lack of experience in shipbuilding, even without a shipbuilding facility, he persuaded his customer to give him an order to build a ship for tens of millions of dollars. Now the company that he started is the largest shipbuilder in the world. The one that we should all remember is, it is failures rather than successes that teach us invaluable lessons. It is not necessary to remember one's success. That should be remembered by others instead. Rather, we should remember our losses and failures. Those who forget their failures will fail again and again and again.